Trings was a well-known shop in Mitcham when I was growing up. It was located at Monarch Parade on London Road, on the other side of the road from the Mitcham Library. The only photograph I've come across is this one on the Merton Memories Archive, circa 1987, where it is simply Trings Discount, where they're selling Japanese makes, Panasonic, Sony. But when did Trings start? And what about the Trings Sports Shop, which next door on this 1987 photograph seems to be still as a sports shop, but now called A and B Sports. So, let's dive in. Our first clue is an advert from 1947. The ad celebrates their first anniversary on the 30th of August, 1947. So that's pretty good. That means we now know that Trings first opened on the 30th of August, 1946. Curiously, it was called a sports and radio store. Trings Limited, Monarch Parade, Mitcham. Mitcham's modern sports and radio store. We're having pleasure in announcing our first sale to commence at 9am tomorrow, Saturday the 30th, and last in seven days. This is a genuine sale. We shall offer for disposal, amongst hundreds of other bargains, 40 second-hand radio sets, a large number of shades and electrical fittings, etc. Special bargains in the sports and toys department. So there you go, they started in 1946, selling sports equipment, radios and toys. That ad didn't actually give their address at Monarch Parade. But this one does. It's the 1948 edition of the official journal of the North Mitcham Improvement Association, The Sentinel. Trains are enthusiastic about bush radio and television. Installation by aerial experts. Maintenance by fully qualified television engineers. 9 inch tube console, 70 pounds. Or a 12 inch tube console, 84 pounds. And there's the address 40 stroke 41, Monarch Parade. So let's have a look at the Ordnance Survey map from 1952. We can see that numbers 40 and 41 are shown on this map as a double sized shop. This fits our photograph we had of 1987 of the front of Trings. There aren't any other photographs of what it looked like in those days. This tuck postcard claims to be 1950 and we can see what Monarch Parade looked like in those days. So at some time, I think after the 1980s, the building was rendered and we lost that brick design on the front. This ad from the 1949 Youth Handbook is just for the sports shop. Trings, your local sports shop. Every sport catered for. Cricket bats, hockey sticks, footballs, etc. Repaired by experts. A list of all the sports there. 24 hour repair service. Tennis rackets restrung from 15 shillings. Single strings, 9 pence. Agents for Dumlop, Grays, Gradage, Slazingers, Sykes, Spalding, Stuart, Surridge, Wisden, etc. etc. Trings, 40 stroke 41, Monarch Parade, Bisham. Telephone, MIT 4884. And here are some ads from 1950. And this is from a football programme. And this ad from 1959 does have a photograph of the inside of the shop. Where it says, this photograph shows a section of our modern showrooms. Where 30 television sets are being demonstrated simultaneously. They also had an audition room for stereo and hi-fi. Now the address says 31, 40 and 41, Monarch Parade. They were selling radios, televisions, radiograms, which were record players that also had radios. Record players, tape recorders, agents for Bush, Decker, Echo, GC, HMV, KB, McMichael, Phillips... So Bell and Ultra. If you prefer to rent your television, you can have the set of your choice. No deposit, room aerial free, no repair bills, only 10 shillings per week. For a 17 inch set. Is that the size of the screen or the size of the actual physical thing itself? Domestic appliances also sold. Washing machines, refrigerators, spin dryers and vacuum cleaners. 
Stockists were Electrolux, Frigidaire, Hoover, Hotpoint, Remington, Ronson, Phillips and GEC. You can have any goods you require on our popular easy terms. Nine months credit, no interest charges, small deposit, longer periods. One shilling in the pound interest charges. So 20 shillings of pounds, 120th is 5%. Remember, Trings is a family business, therefore you get personal attention at all times. This 1960 ad for a refrigerator is of interest because the logo for Trings has now changed. Instead of it being just capital letters, it's more of a more of a bouncy type shape. Trings, old Mitchum. 31, 40, 41, Monarch Parade. That same style was also retained in this 1971 ad for the sports shop, which appeared in the 1971 Mitchum Cricket Club yearbook. Trains of Mitchum, the sports shop, are the sports specialist. Every sport case of for at competitive prices. There's no argument about it, says the ad. However, it's worth pointing out that in 1963, Trings actually split up. Unfortunately, we have a notice in a newspaper that tells us tells a story. Mr. J. Tring has disposed of the shares of the above company to Mr. C. Howes. Mr. Tring would like to take this opportunity of thanking all his old friends and customers for their past support. It is hoped they will continue to support Mr. Howes, who in return will give the same personal and high-class service. Tring's Sport, Mitchum Limited, has been retained by Mr. Tring. Therefore, the sports shop will continue to be managed by Mr. Patrick Barrymore. We trust we may have the pleasure of continuing to serve our many friends. So, Tring started off with... So, Mr. J. Tring started Tring's in 1946 as a sports and radio shop. The radio business boomed into televisions, appliances, and so forth. But it looks like Mr. Tring really wanted to just do sports because that's what he kept after he disposed of his shares in Tring's Mitchum Limited in 1963. Mr. James Thomas Tring, born 1904 in Battersea, passed away on the 20th of August 1992 at the age of 88. I'm fairly confident this was the fellow who set up Tring's because in 1939 his residence was St. George, or St. George's Road, Mitchum, sorry. And in a newspaper article in November 1950, a Mr. J.T. Tring, or St. George's Road, Mitchum, was fined for, the, for allowing the improper storage of fireworks at his premises at Monarch Parade. So there you have it. That's what I have managed to research about Trings. Started in 1946. Mr. Tring split off the sports shop in 1963. He passed away in 1992. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you liked it, tap that like button. If you didn't like it, tap the dislike button. Leave a comment. Perhaps you know when the shop actually closed. Which shop? The electric shop, the electronic shop, the sports shop. Anyway, bye for now.